More questions than answers. Investigators are trying to figure out who murdered the son of a former University of Maryland head football coach. 25-year-old Miko Loxley was shot in a quiet Columbia neighborhood. WJZ is live at Howard County Police Headquarters. Rick Ritter speaks with those who knew Loxley and has the very latest from police. Rick? Well, just police do not have a lot of answers in this tragic killing. They are still searching for a motive, now offering a $5,000 reward while the suspect is still on the loose. He was once a rising football star and the son of a longtime coach at the University of Maryland. But at just 25 years old, Miko Loxley was gunned down just blocks from where he lived. He was actually a really good person. He was not in the streets or nothing. The call came in around 10 o'clock Sunday night in Columbia. Police responded to this apartment complex at the 5500 block of Harper's Farm Road, where multiple callers reported hearing a single gunshot. It was right here, like right, right here. Kendrick Sessions heard what he thought was fireworks and witnessed the aftermath. You came back and you saw his body was yeah. right. It was right here, and then the ambulance came and they tried to resuscitate him for like three minutes. Loxley used to play football for the University of New Mexico and then Lackawanna College in Pennsylvania. He was working at a subway store minutes away from where he was killed. Nico is a good guy. Uh, and he's a hard working guy too. His dad, Mike, a former assistant and interim coach for the Terps, is now the co offensive coordinator for the University of Alabama. Coaches from around the country showed their support for Loxley, including Nick Saban. Our thoughts and prayers go out to Mike, uh, Ms. Kia, and the entire Loxley family. A tragedy that's rocked parts of the college football world while investigators beg for the public's help to figure out what led to the bloodshed. Detectives are talking to people um, and following up on those leads right now. And police have not released any information on a potential suspect at this time. Miko leaves behind his parents, two brothers, and a sister. Jess. Very sad, Rick. Thank you. Anyone with information on Loxley's murder is urged to call Howard County Police at 410-313-STOP.